Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see Libra, what's going on with you? All right, so how is Libra coming into the reading? How is Libra coming into the reading? Okay, fear, ooh. All right, so fearful. Um, maybe even making decisions out of fear. I heard like running out of time. Um, so this could be even, even translated as getting older. Um, this could be triggered emotions. You coming into the maternity. Okay, so maybe you fear being pregnant. You fear being a mother. Um, there's some fear surrounding your children if you have any. Um, it's just fear altogether. Maybe you fear um, not having a, being able to give your children the lifestyle that they deserve or that you feel like they deserve. Um, fear and maternity. So, and then they're both kind of like orange cards. So it's like growth. Maybe you fear um, how your children are growing or if they're being nourished. What is this about? What is this fear and maternity? Fear of missing out. Ooh. So you could be dealing with somebody who, um, this could even could be your energy, Libra. You need to put more time into your, your children. Even if you're a masculine energy or man, you need to kind of tap into that little, that feminine maternal energy. And maybe you need to put more time into a child or children, fear of missing out. You fear missing out on your children, or maybe you're dealing with a lot of different women and you have children with a lot of different women, they fear that you're not going to be able to put uh, effort, energy, time, money, resources, just you into the upbringing of the child here. Um, you could even fear that you've got someone pregnant. You're just not ready for this. Some of you fear that you're going to miss out on procreating. You know, maybe you feel like you're going to miss the mark here. You, you know, maybe it hasn't happened for you. You don't have any children. Let's see how the other person, whomever you're coming to the reading for, how they feel. You are my sunshine. So somebody feels like you are just everything. Yes, you are the one. Okay. Um, even through your flaws, even through your fear, they feel like you are the one. They see through something. Okay. Maybe they see the good in you shining through. Um, yeah, they see that good in you dominating, you know, even though your fear, your person is coming to you as I want to surprise you with a new life, new home, new car, new baby, just a big surprise. OK, um, some of you, you've got somebody here who just wants things to go well. You got somebody here who looks at you in a very an awesome light. OK, they really want to give you everything that you deserve or that they feel like you deserve. You are the one. You're their sunshine. Um, they could even be a little stuck on you. Uh, you dominate their thoughts. Um, they see the good that shines through. You're in a place of fear, fear. Of maybe if you stay with this person, you're going to miss out on something. Let's see what the advice is for Libra. What is the angel answers cards? What's the advice for Libra? Let's see it unlikely it's unlikely that you're going to miss out you don't need to rest in fear um put more energy into something that maybe you haven't been putting in energy to some of you fear i heard like maybe um fer fertility issues i don't know if you have fertility issues ask others for help if you do um your person feels like you're the one you guys can get through this don't worry it's unlikely that they're going to leave you or that they don't want you it's something that you can move through some of you feel like something about old or being old or getting older all right so that's what i have for you if it resonates go over to the website book there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below catch me live tonight sunday night 8 30 p.m eastern standard time come for the collective reading ask a question or two thank you libra take care